What's up, Madden 25 fans? I just wanted to give you guys another beginner tip. And something that you'll hear me all the time talk about is motion snaps. How do you, and, and typically you'll hear me say something like this, motion the ROS slot receiver in three steps and snap the ball. And some of you guys may think, oh, I don't really know how to motion, or how do you motion it? What is that? And how do you snap the ball while they're in motion? What you want to do is on PlayStation 4 or Xbox One, it's the circle button or the B button. So on PS4 it's circle, on Xbox One it's B. You're going to hit that, and you see how it's going to move the back off, and now you see how it clicks onto Steve Smith, and it's going to give you that icon of whether or not you, you can go left. Sometimes you can go left and right. Uh, and we'll just cycle across here. See, now we're on Williams. You see how I can go left and right. Now, how you move him in motion is by using that D-pad. You either want to put the D-pad to the left or put it, push it to the right, depending on where you're wanting him to go. So one popular thing that I use to beat man coverage is I'll put the slot receiver on a slant route, and then I'll circle over him to him by using that uh, tip that I already just gave about uh, what button to push, and I'll motion snap him in two steps. So I'm going to motion over. After he takes two steps, I'm going to motion and snap and there you see now we're being able to beat man-to-man -man coverage. So that's how you motion snap in Madden 25, guys. It should be the same in Madden 15. And I hope that you guys are able to take this tip because this is uh, arguably one of the biggest things that I do on every play. You almost always see me putting a guy in motion, and typically it's going to help you beat man-to-man -man coverage. Motion snaps are essential to getting better at Madden, and I hope this video taught you how I like to motion snap in Madden NFL. 15.